Now let's do some calculations reviewing a fertilizer label for a liquid material. This particular product is a 4, 10, 10 and you see in its guaranteed analysis how the nitrogen is broken up. Everything in this product is going to be water soluble. So you see that right there, ammoniacal, nitrate, and urea nitrogen. And it's 10% by weight available phosphoric acid, 10% by weight soluble potash. Okay. Now, what we need with liquid sources is we need to know the weight per gallon when we start working about how much of these products do I need. Okay, so every gallon of this material weighs 10.32 pounds. So right off the bat, if every gallon weighs 10.32 pounds, we can determine how much nitrogen, phosphate, and potash is in a gallon of fertilizer. We're taking 10.32 times 0.04. 10.32 times 0.1, 10.32 times 0.1, right? See that? So we do our math, 10.32 times 0.04 equals 0 0.41 pounds of N per gallon, okay? And a tenth, this one's going to be right at 1.0 pounds of P2O5 per gallon. And again, this is going to be 1 pound of K2O per gallon. Okay. Then when you're making the applications, if you want to apply, say, 1 pound of nitrogen per 1,000 square feet, what do you do? Okay, well, we know that there is... My goal is one pound of nitrogen. Okay, what do we have? Well, we have, well, I know there's 0 0.41 pounds of N in one gallon of product, right? Just did that in this calculation right here. So, if my desire is for one pound of nitrogen, how many gallons would that be? Remember, when you do a proportion, it doesn't matter as, well, what's on top, what's on bottom, as long as you're consistent. So I've got pounds of nitrogen both on top, and I've got gallons in the bottom. So we cross multiply and divide, and I'm going to have 0 0.41 times x equals 1, right? 1 times 1. Okay, and then I'm going to divide both sides by 0.41. 1 divided by 0.41 equals 2.43. And remember our units here are gallons. 2.43 gallons. And 2.43 gallons contains 1 pound of nitrogen. And that makes sense because there was 0.41 pounds in 1 gallon. So we know we needed more than 2 gallons in order to get something getting close to uh, a pound of nitrogen. So that's working with a liquid fertilizer. Don't let the fact that it's a liquid bother you. Just be sure that you do pay attention to what its weight per gallon is in making the calculations.